Step one, wake up early, gon' rise with the sun. Step two, get some good, some food in you. Step three, think grow hard about what you wanna be. Step four, f everybody, just do your thing. Wake up, today's gonna be a good day. Hey guys, welcome back, welcome to my channel. So today's video, we are doing my June TBR. How are we already in June? I say this every month, but how are we already in June? Um, this month's TBR is going to be done a little bit different. We're not doing prompts. We are going to be using my personal scratch card. So this has my physical TBR on it. So books that I need to get read from my physical shelf because it's getting a little, little crazy now. There's a lot of books on there that need to be read. So we are going to be using this. There are currently some that have already been scratched off because I've either read them for videos, did not to read, so I've already used it per se. Um, this month's booklet pick, let me actually grab it. Um, I've already read this month's booklet pick, but it is It Happened One Summer by Tessa Bailey. So if you guys want to join us on the book club, you can join us down below. The link is there. I have annotated this book a bit crazy. So I have all my thoughts and opinions here ready to go. I might do a reread of it. I might not. I'm going to see how I feel. But yes, we are doing It Happened One Summer next month. Let's get her started on this one and what we're going to be reading for the month of june so i think i'm going to pick four to five depending on the sizing of them when they come off my shelf um this is what i'm going to read because i do have some videos planned so i do already have some books in mind but yeah that's kind of where we're going to be at so four to five depending on the size so let's go for this first one. Oh, okay all right i don't know how i feel about this one so the first one again is the prisoner of throne prisoner's throne by holly black now i'm not as you guys may know i'm not a big fan of the fuck of air series i did enjoy the stolen air a little bit more it was okay i wasn't still a big fan of it but it did get left on a hanger so it meant i then needed to pick up the prisoner's throne so i knew what happened because it left me my hand out. As much as I, it was okay, and, but not my favourite, I need to know what happens. So we're going to pick this up. And then I think once I finish this one, I can decide what I'm going to do with the books and whether I'm going to keep them or sell them. So technically a perfect opportunity to help me decide if books are going to be coming off my shelf or not. <laughs> so that's our first pick. Um, that's great growing. Let's pick another one, shall we? To be fair, at least it's not that big. Okay. <laughs> The next one is unfortunately yours by Tessa Bailey. Um, I read Secretly Yours and again, it's another one of those ones that was okay. Not a fave, but I enjoyed it. So we're gonna go for Unfortunately Yours and see what happens. I kind of think I remember the characters because I know you do meet them in Secretly Yours. I think I remember them. Not so great, but we shall see. We shall see. We shall give it a go. Um, <laughs> it's been sat there for ages, guys. I need to get rid of it. Not get rid of it. I need to read it. You knew what I meant. You knew what I meant. Right, let's go for another one. Oh, okay. This is perfect. Because it finishes off a series for me. And that is If We Were Perfect by Anna Huang. Which is absolutely perfect. Like I said, this will finish off... Ooh, this will finish off the If Love series for me for Anna Hong and kind of get me up to date. As it stands, I still need to read King of Sloth, but hopefully that'll be finished by the end of May. But yeah, this will finish me off this series. I've enjoyed it. I'm, in, I'm, ugh, I'm intrigued about these characters because we've seen them in the other books. So we know what happens with them there. And now we're going to finish off their story and find out where things went from where we la last last left them. They've been side characters, but like very much we know what's going on with them. So I'm intrigued for some more details and to find out how they finished their relationship off. So that's four already. See, this is really quick because I don't have the prompts and I don't have to think about it. I'm just getting the books. Picking our TBR this month is so much more easier. <laughs> I should have been doing this from the start. It makes it so much more easier for me. Right. Let's go for number four. Go for number four. We've technically got four on our TBR because I'm undecided if I'm going to reread It Happened One Summer or not. But 
So three times before. Oh, oh, oh. Next up, we have Babel or Babel by R. Kwong. That is this chunker of a book. This has been sat on my shelf for ages. Now, it seems like a really intriguing book. It seems like one I could enjoy. <laughs> oh, that just went to shit. Yeah. Um, I don't know what else to say to you guys about this one. It's just, I've, I know what it's roughly about. I haven't read too much into it because I just kind of wanted to go into it blind. But it has been sat there for a while because of its size. Now, sc skies. Size does not scare me. But when you have so many books to read, it becomes very daunting to try, then pick up a big book to try and read within a month. And looking on my shelf of what books I've got to read still as well, I have some other big ones. So, this could be the end of my TBR. Because so far we have picked these books. And then obviously you've got It Happened All Summer with some possibility. Do I risk the biscuit and go for a fifth one? Keep in mind what I really need to read. Do we do it? Do we say fuck it and go for it? Do we just say fuck it and give it a go and just stress me out for the month of June? Let's do it. Let's stress me out for the month of June. Say fuck it. Um, what one do I want to go for? You know what? I'm going to go. Let's go down here. Bottom corner. Go in bottom corner. Okay. We have the Atlas Complex by Olivia Blake. Now, it's another big one. I do love the cover and the spine and the edges. This one I already have planned to read for a video. So this was already in my TBR for the month. Okay, I'll be very honest with you guys. That was already in my TBR for the month to read. So, do I then say, fuck it again, and go for another one, because technically this was already in my TBR, this one. Fuck it, go for it. Let's just stress me out, Sky, let's just add more books to my list. It's fine. It's fine. Let's go for this one. Okay. <laughs> this is definitely the last one. Definitely the last one. It is My Dark Desires by Parker S. Huntington and LJ Shen which is this one this is definitely reached the end of our TBR because there is no way your girl can then try and get any more books in no way absolutely no fucking way can I try and squeeze in anymore with what I've already got else to read it's just not happening. It's just not happening. Especially because I got the 18 plus book club pick as well. That's also in our Discord if you guys want to come join it. Again, it's down below. We do an 18 plus book as well for every month. So I got that as well. Plus the books for the videos. I'm stopping there. Okay, we're not gonna stress me out anymore. We're not doing we're not stress we're not doing it. We're not gonna stress me out. We're gonna stop there. We're just going to leave it as this enjoy enjoyable, enjoyable TBR. And I'm going to ask you guys to hope and pray for the best for me. And that's me thinking, like, doing it like this will be so much nicer and easier. Less stressful. Calm is a bitch, isn't it? Calm is a fucking bitch. Calm and calm for me. So, yeah, we're going to leave it there. Nice short TBR video this time. That is our six books, seven, six, seven books. Then plus obviously what I've got planned for videos. So it's going to be a, hopefully a good reading month. Fingers crossed. But yes, I am going to, I'm going to head up there. And I'm going to catch you guys in the next one. Let me know if any of those books are in your TBR. I, I can't hold them up again. That was hurting my arm. Let me know if any of those books are in your TBR for the month or on your list or you've read them let me know down below in the comments and yeah i'm gonna catch you guys in the next one don't forget to keep smiling be kind keep reading bye guys wake up today's gonna be a good day wake up today's gonna be a good day wake up today's gonna be a good day wake up
Today's gonna be a good day. Wake up. Today's gonna be a good day.